The United Nations Children Education Fund, UNICEF, has urged the federal government to invest more in developing the nation's children and youths. The UN Fund made this call during its maiden edition of the Niger Youth Talk held in Abuja with the theme, The Nigeria We Want. UNICEF's Chief of Basic Education, Euphrates Efosier, who represented his country director, Peter Hawkins, commended the efforts made by the government in the past in investing in children and youths. He, however, taxed the government to do more in integrating youths into society and governance through quality education. FOCA also urged government to ensure children and youths have a voice in the society. UNICEF and partners want to build on the momentum of young people. As we commemorate the 30th anniversary of the Convention of the Rights of the Child this year, and we want to make sure that we keep youth voices at the center of the discourse around what should happen and the kind of future young people should have. Today's conversation tagged the Niger Youth Talk, focusing on the Nigeria we want. We are hoping will allow you to reflect on and celebrate the progress made by the youth to create the Nigeria we all want, as well as build the momentum and support for further action. Despite the gains in the situation facing Nigerian children and young people in recent years, there is much that remains to be done. Too many Nigerian children and young people are being left behind when it comes to education. Nigeria, as our uh, presenters rightly mentioned, has the world's highest number of out-of-school children. And I think the figure she cited was 10.5 million. May I just tell you that these figures are only up to primary level. If we want to look at higher levels of education, junior secondary and secondary level, we are talking about more than 10 million children who are out of school. As children, people feel we are too young to create great impacts. They feel we are blind and cannot see what is going on around us. They feel we are too naive to have certain conversations. They feel we are too little to learn certain things, but they forget that if they don't teach us, we will still learn, probably from the wrong people and sooner than they could even imagine. As a child, I believe that every child deserves better. I believe that our voices need to be heard. I believe that we need to be part of certain conversations and policy formulations, especially ones that are meant for us. There is this Yoruba adage that says, In English, it means an adult does not tell lies. But I know of many adults that tell lies. It means, as a child, if you know an adult is not right, you cannot or should not correct them. This is not fair. I hardly go for programs and see children speak on the same stage as adults. And I'm so excited to see UNICEF creating platforms for children's voices to be heard.